News 46, local coverage you can count on. My name is Mike. I'm with Monkey Bar Garage Storage System. I'd like to wish you a happy holiday. And if you'd like a free estimate in your garage, please give me a call at area code 702-306-8720. Check out what Monkey Bars can do for your garage with professional installation, heavy duty construction, and exceptional prices. Call 702-306-8720 for a free estimate. Happy holidays! Well, we had a uh, two-vehicle accident. We had a gold vehicle stopped on Prompt Valley Boulevard attempting to go across the intersection northbound. And then we had a white SUV traveling westbound on State Route 372. The uh, Oldsmobile, driver of the Oldsmobile did not um, fail or uh, failed to yield to the uh, SUV um, and ended up colliding with that vehicle. The white SUV seemed to have spun completely around and up on the curb. Yes, it did, um, and that's based on basically being hit in the rear axle um, from the front of the other vehicle. It actually took the rear end of the vehicle and, and spun it around. And we had a child inside that car, too, as well, that uh, was checked out? Yes, uh, the child is fine. Um, he was in a, uh, a car seat um, and strapped in like he was supposed to, so uh, the baby did not sustain any injuries that I'm aware of. And inside the Oldsmobile, there was two passengers or two occupants? There's only one occupant in the uh, Oldsmobile and, and then the inside. SUV. And then nobody else in any other vehicles were injured? No, no injuries uh, from anybody that are they're claiming just property damage. And they'll be getting a citation, I assume? Absolutely, there'll be a citation for fail to yield uh, to oncoming traffic. Do you have any advice for us on this intersection? I know that this is one where we get a lot of accidents. Absolutely. Uh, the best advice, uh, two things. One, make sure you're wearing your seatbelt. Uh, I do believe that this is a major contributing factor with this crash, why there was no injuries, is because everybody had their seatbelts on. The second thing is, is when you're coming to an intersection, Take the extra three seconds that it takes to look both ways and then double check again before you come through the intersection. And uh, other uh, types of crashes that we have here, sometimes people say that they, can't, they couldn't see because it was a vehicle turning right or turning left. Well, the thing is, if you can't see all travel lanes, don't go. It, it's not safe until you can clear all directions. So it's that little assumption right there that causes things like this to happen. Exactly, exactly. Another three to five seconds at the intersection would save people a tremendous amount of time from being here in an accident and also possibly keep people from getting hurt. Great advice from Trooper Hubs there. If you are in need of a car seat, you can call the Nye County Sheriff's Office at 751-7000. They have a free car seat program and of course pull over to both sides of the roadway when emergency vehicles are passing. Drive carefully. This is Deanna O'Donnell for News 46.